study is based on the Prevent Dementia study. So this is a study of midlife healthy adults with very little pathology. So this makes it very well placed to look at early cognition and early risk factors. So what we found was um, we looked at modifiable and non-modifiable risk factors. And so the non-modifiable risk factors were things like inherited risk, and those things were actually not associated with midlife small vessel disease. Whereas the modifiable risk factors, you know, things like hypertension, diabetes, physical activity, things like that, those were the ones that were related to small vessel disease. And the thing is, these risk factors, they're actually supposed to be risk factors of future dementia, 20 years later or so. But the thing is, it's already being uh, noticed to affect small vessel disease much earlier in life. So even in these really healthy midlife adults, you already see these differences. So that kind of suggests that, you know, it might be that this risk, these risk factors are actually operating through um, a cardiovascular, cerebrovascular route instead.